Hey guys, Chris here. Uh, I'm going to show you today how to open a private window or incognito window in Safari. Um, this is good if, you know, what they say, if you want to shop for like a present and you don't want somebody to see you really, it's if you're on porn and you don't want people to see your porn sites. This is what it's for, but it's really simple, whatever reason you may be using it for. Um, so you're gonna open up Safari and at the top or left here, um, you'll see, so right now it opens in a default regular window. Um, so, you know, websites are being saved, tracked, all that good stuff. Uh, if you go to File and click New Private Window, you are now in private browsing mode. So, um, it won't remember history, it won't try and fill in passwords or anything like that. Um, say if you were on Facebook or you go to Facebook now, um, it'll probably ask you to log in, all that type of stuff. But, um, pretty simple, but, <clears throat> um, you know, useful for whatever your purposes are. Um, that people, you know, want people to see your, your web history or whatever, that's how you do it. So again, real quick review, you're going to open up Safari and you're just going to hit file, new private window, and you'll kind of see the task bars like grayed out. Um, to let you know you're in a super secret web browsing mode. So hopefully that helps. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know and, uh, comment on why you use the private browsing mode, uh, for porn or for, uh, just being super sneaky and as always thanks for watching subscribe if you like the video if you have other things you need help on or tips on how to do something please leave a comment below uh, and i'll be happy to try and make a video to show you thanks for watching guys